Our law enforcement academy at Eastern Kentucky University provided my next ray of hope when they announced they were letting our nine academy recruits there for training be released to attend today's funeral. And again, I thought of Brandon, who was and still is today one of their finest recruits ever. He was so excited to put on his Class A Sheriff's uniform for the first time. If you have looked at some of the many photos the last two days, you can see the pride in his eyes. But my favorite ray of hope is the one taken by a woman in our courthouse where Brandon was working. He was not just telling a blind lady how to get to the courtroom she was looking for. He took her by the arm and led her down the hallway to her destination. A worker in the courtroom, courthouse, was walking behind Brandon and he had no clue. But she took a picture and it shows them uh, walking away with his arm on hers, taking, where, taking her where she wanted to go. It captured a moment and it captures what Brandon really is and was. For you see, Deputy Brandon Shirley was himself one of our brightest rays of hope. I told the over 50, 60 Honor Guard members you have seen guarding his casket that Brandon was the kind of, kind of officer you would want to ride with. He would always have your back. But make no mistake, Brandon Shirley's ray of hope did not dim with his death. He left us with a template, a model, a vision, and what to look for as we search for new people to join our family of law enforcement service. So rest in peace, my brother. We have your duty watch now. And on behalf of a grateful sheriff, and the men and women of our office, thank you for your support of the Brandon family, for Austin, and for this community. May God bless you all, and stay safe.